This is the coolest skate trick you'll ever see. Because it ends with a hug Jeremy waited 18 years for. I've never been here before. You've never been here before? Hey, Mom, watch me. Heard what he said? Oh my God. When I was younger, she couldn't, um, she couldn't really take care of me and my sisters. It was kind of like a financial problem. And not only that, she was in a toxic relationship. Jeremy's mom, Carmen, had three children. His sister, Sophia, was looked after by her dad. And his sister, Tara, was adopted by family friends. She was trying to hold on to me as long as she could. But she knew that I could probably have a better family to grow up with. I wouldn't have to deal with all the moving around. And at times, I might not even have food or whatever. So she wanted to give me to somebody that was going to take good care of me. And Jeremy did get adopted by a family that took good care of him. But he told us he would still think about his biological family often. It was always a burden on my heart. Like, I wish I could go see them. I wish I knew where they were. And I, I looked and looked and I searched and searched. I just could not find them. Until one day, his adopted mom found a binder with his sister's dad's name in it, which led him to find her on Facebook. I remember just sitting there for five minutes after we sent the message and just praying and asking the Lord. I was like, Lord, uh, just make this as easy as like talking, like text, uh, messaging a random stranger and it actually be my sister. I added both of them on Facebook right then and Tara said she was just sitting there and she saw uh, that she had like got a friend request from a guy named Jeremy. She's like, uh, uh this can't be it. Like this, there's no way. <laughs> We waited to tell my mom or even to be able to see each other because we wanted to go surprise my mom. They were like, why don't we do it at a park? She's going to get really loud. I was just sitting there like, oh man, this is crazy. This is like a dream. Like I was kind of panting back and forth. Like my heart was pounded. Mom, watch me. Heard what he said? Oh my God. Tara? Is it Tara? Hey, Tara what? What? You, did you hear what he said? Are you filming? Yeah. Why? Did you hear what he said? Yeah. What he say? Who? Are you? <laughs> Carmen. <laughs> it was like a dream like even you know, my mom kept saying she was like this, this can't be real like I, I need to wake up I'm in a dream right now and it literally felt like a dream it was like I, I was like sleeping <laughs> I needed to wake up too I just want to thank her for like even though she couldn't take care of me like making the decision to like say you know what he deserves a better lifestyle than what he's growing up in she had prayed that I would have a better family that loved the Lord and would raise me up uh, the right way and do the right things uh, better than it, better than it which she could at the time. And I just thank her for um, just never giving in or giving up on her joy and uh, never letting people st uh, take her peace away from her. And I love the fact that she's so she has so much joy and uh, peace and. I just love her.